Hello and welcome back to Jusson. That's definitely the way we should go. Say no to locks. Water and people should be able to flow freely. We can deny the many for the sake of the few. In the current crisis, it's our duty to stand in solidarity with living things. To confine the water is to confine us all. Regular information ses sessions uh, at the market canteen. The White Water Collective. Mm. Oh, we could have go over here. Community Canteen. Upcoming activities. Permanent team to fight water insecurity. Uh, fundraising dinners for the White Water Collective. Repair workshop. All items accepted. Uh, note. The canteen will now open one prime earlier to reduce overcrowding. Pay what you can. To help in the kitchen, arrive early in the sleep. All help welcome. No one comes by anymore. I haven't sold a single flower. Should I switch careers? But I don't know how to do anything besides taking care of plants. I might as well write poetry, right? Or try to at least. Roses are red, violets are blue. 
Where or where has everyone gone to? Oops. Yeah. should go. Oh. I think I saw. No. I mean... Relic is at issue 37, 8 octaves and 2 fifths after the Jew song. Editorial. In this issue of the Gazette, we will be looking at an animal from the outside for world, the weave beak. Weave beaks are the only animals found in every region of the tower, every known region at least. Sometimes they even venture into our tunnels. These medium sized birds are known for their all white feathers and blue comb. It's not uncommon to see the playful birds gliding through the warm drafts that rise up the cliffs of the tower. They are also extremely curious and can often be found perched near climbing roots, observing and commenting on what's happening with their fellow birds. Not only are weave big social creatures, they're also skilled builders. They work together to build their nests, which have multiple entrances and can house dozens of weave beaks. They are constantly strengthening and expanding their nests and are always on the lookout for twigs. Hence the expression walking like a weave beak. Did you know, weave beaks comes uh, open and close depending on the mood. A wide open comb means that the weave beak is alert or stressed about something or someone. But enough chatter, keep reading for an in-depth look at the lives of these outwardly unassuming yet fascinating birds. Dear editor, I've only read the editorial and I'm already outraged. It all sounds very nice, but you might want to think twice before publishing some nonsense. Weave beaks are thieves. They're always stealing my wood to build their nests. I I'm unsubscribing. Signed, a disgruntled citizen. Hmm. Where was that way?
become now different and of moping around. The situation isn't as hopeless as that. I'm quite certain the water supply is being managed by some very competent people. I have no doubt that they have a clearer plan to get us out of this mess. Believe me, there's no cause for concern. Are you still coming over for tea? We filled the basin. Nothing like a bit of swimming to chase away the blues. Oh no.
We made it. Let's pretend that that was the plan all along. Sorry, Ida, I have to go to the market. The rotor inlet is acting up again. Things are starting to get complicated. I really thought that about holding back the water, but there's nothing to be done. The basins are empty. I think it's time for a more radical change. What would have happened if we had let the water flow freely from the start? I'm boring you of my musings, but sometimes I get the feeling we've made a big mistake. There's a pier collapsing in the boatman's district. Do you think you could take care of it? Hey, Joe, things are non-stop at the moment. I'll have to go fishing for a f new team to shore it up. Issa's already over at the two pillars' side. As for the other stuff, I don't know what to say. What's done is done. <sighs> Alright, I'll pack up the supplies I need, and then I'm off to the boatman's district. And this is where I'm gonna end this part. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye.